Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So the Apocalypse Arena is over round one. I went for the four star, but before we get into the leaderboards, I wanted to show you guys, as you see on screen right now, uh, some comments made by someone who is apparently a great fan of mine. Uh, but you can see the comments he made, and you will notice that I have replies to each of his comments. All right, so let me uh, switch over here. And you can see the replies that I made to him. So on live stream, I've told you guys that I am a very analytical person, and I like to analyze things. So right away, when I was seeing these comments, I didn't get upset. You know, I'm not upset or anything, uh, but what it let me know is that here is a person who is frustrated and they're lashing out. They're frustrated because they're not able, perhaps, to get the champions that they want. And so when they see someone that has an easy time, they get upset. It was the same thing when Brian Grant and some others would go for uh, legend runs because it was enjoyable. And you have people that didn't have a legend title and they felt that they shouldn't go for a legend run because they already had the title. Of course, that's not the only reason that you go for them. Well, as you've seen, Kabam has been releasing content more and more that target four stars. So I like four stars and Apocalypse, especially with all of those synergies, is going to be very useful. But I like collecting four stars. So as you see, what I told him I'm going to go for four stars. Every single four star that comes out, I'm going to go for them. You know, I'm sorry if uh, someone doesn't get the champion and I got the champion and someone that could have gotten the champion didn't because I got the champion. But as I mentioned to him, this is Marvel Contest of Champions. I was where he was once, and that is how I built this roster that he mentioned. Now, you'll notice the mention of MSD. So here is my analysis. This is a person who's already feeling inadequate. And when you feel inadequate or you're hurt or anything like that, you tend to want others to feel that way. So MSD is an extremely skilled player. He won uh, the competition that Kabam had at a uh, Comic-Con, right? So everyone knows how skilled he is. So what would you say the purpose of this person mentioning that MSD went through without Aegon? What is he saying? What he's trying to, you know, point out is you're not as good if you need to have Aegon. Somebody that, you know, is skilled like MSD can do it without, which is, of course, true, but it's not the issue. I can do it without Aegon, but it's going to be more expensive. I'm not as skilled as MSD. I'm not as skilled as several of the uh, YouTubers that I watch. There are quite a few people that are far more skilled than I am. Uh, but I get stuff done, and I get them done in my way. And one of the ways that I can keep the cost down is to go in there with Aegon. So it doesn't matter how many people do it without Aegon. I'm not going in there without Aegon unless a new champion comes out and they can do what Aegon does as well or better than Aegon could. All right. But anyway, so that is my quick little analysis. So let's uh, get to the main dish. So let's find out if I got him and you're going to see something because I normally put up, you know, 15, 16 million when I go for a champion. But after I read those comments, I got inspired. And I decided to put up a little bit more than I normally do. All right, so let's go ahead and check out the arenas. And uh, you can see I'm already started on the uh, Sunday arena. I haven't run my five or six stars yet, but I'll do that later. So let's go ahead and look at that. I can see it off to the right. We got him ranked 36. 
Uh, you can see the rest of them. I pretty much just went for milestones and of course the 2000 shards. We also went for the three star and we got the three star. So those are the two that I wanted from this arena. Next arena is going to be a pretty leisurely grind. Probably not going to go for the dupe on him, but I might. Um, but probably not. He doesn't even need to be duped. Um, and if I want to awaken him, I can. So let's start left to right with the four star. And you can see I put up 20 million. So that set of comments inspired me to put up about 4 million more than I normally would. Um, but let's take a look and let's see who else got up here on this leaderboard. Okay, I see some names that I recognize, of course, uh, from other uh, arena leaderboards. All right. Uh, Dark Lord, congratulations. I recognize that name. And there I am. So 35 people were crazier than I was. Or they just had higher, uh, uh, larger rosters. The Glory of Man, I don't know you personally, but congratulations. I, I know you through, um, I think, Brian Grant's uh, stream. So congratulations there. See, <laughs> stud muffin. Oh, okay. Uh, let's see. Since I spent so much time in the beginning there. Um, I don't think that's you. Is that you, Farouk? Yeah, that's not how you usually spell your name, even though I probably pronounce them the same. But, you know, I'm trying to go a little bit fast. Uh, I lack skills. Congratulations. 85. Yep. Get that uh, four star, man. All right. And uh, if you got the champion, you know, let us know what you uh, put up. It might help some people. Asmodeus, congratulations. Um, it might help some people uh, who are thinking about going for him in round two. But the scores that I saw for the five star, mm -mm, not me. Uh, Ghost Fade, congratulations, man. Let's see. Hopefully I don't miss anybody. Um, George, is that you? Congratulations. All right. Uh, and if I miss you, just let me know. Big Blue, this is one time where 151 is okay. In this arena, the top 800 get the champion. So uh, we're all good. Everyone that we see here got the champion plus another uh, 600. Let's see. But these are just the creme de la creme. Okay. Yeah, try and go a little bit faster. Mainly because um, I took so much time in the beginning uh, with those comments because they amused me. What can I say? Uh, they gave me something to sink my teeth into and analyze. That's I told you guys that I do that all the time. All right. So four star basic is Venom the Duck. Uh, if you haven't watched uh, my live stream, um, and I am going to be making uh, some videos that will be coming out this week on Varian. I've already done the video on the first uh, quest, and uh, I'll be doing each of the other quests and releasing them throughout this week. So uh, one of them, I use Venom the Duck quite often uh, in the um, my six-star version. Uh, I forget which quest it is. But you'll get to see him, and I'll talk about him a little bit more while I'm uh, showing you guys, you know, how you use him and that sort of thing. And uh, I like him, but he is a ramp-up champion. Uh, so, you know, I'm not crazy about him, but the reason I used him was just to show uh, how fun he can be when he is uh, ramped up. And for incursions... He can be a lot of fun once again you get him ramped up all right but of course i already have the uh the uh four star and i'm going uh, pretty quickly so if i miss your name please leave a comment 
and uh, let me know what you put up and all that good stuff. Maybe even tell me where you plan on using him or if you just want to collect them because that's what I be doing. Collect, collect, collect. If I don't have them, I want them. Doesn't matter how good they are. I might never take them past uh, rank three. All right, so let's take a look at the three star arena. You can see I put up 1.6. Uh, this one is percentage based. So um, same as the last one for Venom the Duck. So everyone that you saw in the last one for Venom the Duck and for this three star will have the champion plus thousands more. So uh, at 1.6, uh, I was fairly certain I was going to get the champion, but you'll notice that I didn't get a ranking. And I usually don't, but 1.6, I've never missed. Um, in fact, uh, a lot of times I'll do 1.5. I'm curious to see if he went, uh, you know, any higher than a 1.5, but uh, usually 1.5 and 1.6 is more than enough to pick up the uh, three star. But, you know, I don't know um, just because I haven't looked uh, whether the three star has all the synergies as well. Uh, usually that's not the case. So I would suspect that the three star is missing maybe one or two. Um, but the four star should have all of them. And you can easily check. Um, you don't have to have the champion or own the champion. Uh, that was something Kabam added. So if you look in your roster, you will find them there uh, under the unknown filter. And you can just look at their synergies right there. I just don't usually do it. All right. Now for the five star. And I put up my normal 18 million. I actually stopped. I could have kept going to like about 19 or so, but there's no need. Uh, so I was taking it easy. Okay, now, wow. We're not going to even look at that name. Maniac, congratulations. Rank 7. Asmodeus, rank 9. You go, guys. Let me know what you guys put up. Oh. All right. Definitely let me know what you guys put up. Apex Predator, congratulations. I'm assuming that's you. Um, those X's on the end, I think they messed me up the last time and I missed you. Um, but congratulations. Let's see. Trying to pay a little bit. Rim in the Rock, congratulations. Let's see anybody else? Uh, Coat Hanger, congratulations. Yeah, I know a lot of people want this guy. And I'm very curious. Uh, like I said, I'm, I'm hearing scores just like I was thinking, uh, over 80 million. Uh, the cutoff was probably, probably around 85. But uh, don't quote me on that. I don't know for sure yet. Uh, Black Gamer, congratulations. I uh, don't know yet. But uh, someone posted up I think they um, put up 86 million and they were uh, 144 um, I should see their name here in a minute and uh, I'll recognize it when I see it I believe it was 144 okay let's see not seeing any names yeah this this guy his synergies and he's not bad either himself uh, no surprise there. Baby Cham, congratulations, man. What did you put up? Uh, ben Riley, congratulations, man. All right. Yeah. So um, I believe Max Swayze. Uh, uh, let me let me check real quick here. Because uh, someone uh, posted up. Um, it was still calculating, though. So maybe not. Let me see. Yeah, that was him. Max Swayze, 144, 86,139, uh, million 540. Uh, that's what he uh, put up. All right. Let's move that out the way and keep going. So it's going to be somewhere around there. 
All right, so only the top 150 get this champion. So sorry, Duckman, for being 151. Uh, but now, let us observe a moment of silence for those who came so close and yet were so far. A frozen night, but everyone's moving out. We all need time, but there's no way to slow it down. All right. Oh, months behind. I saw your name, man. I'm so sorry. Uh, what did you put up? Because uh, this guy went crazy high. Uh, but anyway, that's going to do it, guys. Um, one last comment. Uh, if you ever wonder how I get these dislikes, well, in the beginning of the video, you saw someone that more than likely gave me a dislike, and they are the type of person that would have multiple accounts and would log into their different accounts and give me a dislike. Okay, that's why I'm happy that those don't really make a difference, doesn't matter. Um, but if you're ever curious, that's somewhat, you know, other people, you know, legitimately dislike the video and they might even leave a comment explaining why. Um, but most of the time, you know, it's just people, you know, sour grapes, that's it. Um, but that's gonna do it. Thank you all for watching. Feel free to leave a comment. Let us know what scores you put up. Uh, what you got, whether you got the champion or not. Uh, so take care and you all have a blessed day.